They call themselves boat people. Hi, I'm Rags. Hi, hi, I'm Rick. A Chelsea community living on water. So it's an amazing place. How long have you been here? I've been here for 25 years. I've been here for 30 years. But outside, the tide is changing. Next to them, new arrivals in the shape of these mega barges rented out for huge profits. And residents claim property developers are not renewing their mooring licenses to make room for even more big boats. There's nowhere else to go. So we'll be living in a cardboard box. I'm 75. Our license runs out when I'm 80. I'll be evicted and God knows what we'll do. They're doing this so that they can bring in these enormous mega boats, huge, huge boats into this beautiful historic bit of London. The houseboats on Cheney Walk are part of old Chelsea history. There have been residents living here since the 1930s. This is a community that's been here for so many decades. We're all around the same age because we've been so happy here. And she agreed, it's destroying a, a community and, and lives. It's destroying a community, our lives, and a bit of the heritage of London. And these are the big boats. Neighbour Margaret Allen says she's already been refused a new mooring licence. So you live in a daily fear that you will get evicted? Absolutely. Currently, that hasn't happened to me. But I have to say, I wake up every morning with the little thought in the back of my mind of, of is it going to be today? These big barges don't come cheap. They're on the market for £16,000 a month and they're so large, the council now say they need planning permission. Our planning committee had a meeting a few days ago where they decided that they want the officers to go and do a detailed assessment as to whether or not there has been a breach. We're really keen that we want to support our residents' voices, but we also have to act within the law. No one from the Chelsea Yacht and Boat Company was available to talk to us, but in a statement said it's wholly incorrect to suggest that boat owners have been unfairly evicted, adding we have no intention whatsoever of causing any distress to boat owners. For now, residents float, waiting for a decision. The council say it will make a ruling on the planning permission of the new boats in the coming weeks. Rags Martel, ITV News, Chelsea.